this video is brought to you by Reolution. Animation used to be really hard and the barrier to entry for creating anything related to 3D animation was very high, no matter what you are trying to do. But with the introduction of some 3D animation software, things are changing for the better. And even beginners can create their own animation projects. One example is iClone. I think to some of you this might be surprising and to others not so much, but iClone is one of the hottest animation software on the market right now. This is the case because it is packed with a long list of awesome features, especially for animators. So if you are a 3D artist, character animator, game developer, or just you are into visualization, crowd simulations, or anything that involves animation, whether it be realistic or stylized, animals, inanimate objects, or anything else, you owe it to yourself to try it. And you probably have tried it before. This tool can do a lot, with seamless compatibility with most 3D software, in addition to some game engines, outstanding UI, and an almost non-existing learning curve, you got yourself an awesome animator toolkit. If you haven't noticed yet, iClone is trying to revolutionize and redefine the way you think about creating animations, especially if you are a beginner. In my opinion, they are doing a great job by inventing new ways of doing things. One of the first things that may catch your attention is that iClone brings with it real-time rendering engine that will allow you to build realistic scenes with lighting and materials and everything else in between. However, it puts more emphasis on animation because it has a powerful mocap system, impressive tools to edit and combine motion capture data, and an inviting library of ready motion presets. But this is not even scratching the surface, because the new version of iClone introduces ways to create automated animations where you can control your characters as you do in video games, because they can automatically detect terrain features, displacement data, in addition to having a lip syncing tool, AI-powered character rigging, non-destructive animation layers editing, and many, many, many other features. iClone is a great and easier alternative if you used Maya and Motion Builder before. It is especially aimed at people who want to do a lot of pre-visualization, educational content, or more refined professional animations. And what I like even more about iClone is its versatile tools for cleaning animations and motion capture data. This alone could take up a whole video, but I recommend checking out Russell Midfield's video on the subject because it is hands down one of the best breakdowns for animation cleaning in iClone. But features like reach target to plan the feet or any joint so you prevent unwanted sliding as well as motion correction, which also minimizes any sliding, especially for moving joints with a ton of control, which makes it a very useful tool that can prevent so many headaches. The Edit Motion Layer function is another great tool that allows you to adjust any joint position during the animation. It is great for correcting posture and joint clipping problems. Because most of the time, if you use an AI-powered animation tool like Deep Motion or Plask or even some of the most advanced motion capture suites, your animation won't be production ready right out of the box. So you have to keep that in mind. But iClone is a great tool that will help you do that and save you so much time during the process. And you can just look at some of the stuff they showcased in their promotional videos. It instantly gives a feeling that you are doing something wrong because of the sheer level of control over everything using simple controls. It makes you feel like the possibilities are literally endless. For instance, Reolution recently introduced Motion Director which allows you to animate a character as you do in a video game, also smoothly transition between different animations and just direct movement while having the ability to control crowd iteration, speed, automatic obstacle detection, and much, much more. And because motion capture is one area where iClone excels, Reolution is offering an awesome course that goes all over the major features and tools that you're gonna need to push your mocap experience to the next level. The course is Mastering Mocap Animation Training, which is gonna help you get up to speed with motion capture workflow in iClone 8. It consists of 35 well-explained and structured lessons, which will focus on three main areas. Mocap correction, 
which will address common problems of managing, cleaning, and fixing your mockup data. And you will see how you can import your motion from renowned motion capture services as well as 3D software. The second part will be all about animation editing and creation. This will help you learn how to use all your motion capture data and finished animations together by seamlessly blending them. And you will see what adjustments you can make to enhance each animation and how to effectively integrate them into your personal projects. Things like altering time and velocity, controlling the speed of the motion, changing direction or looping it, and a ton more of exciting features and lessons that you don't want to miss. And finally, the accurate interaction section, which is gonna tackle the most exciting aspect, in my opinion, namely the dynamic interplay between gestures and objects. This is just a fancy way of saying interactions with the world, meaning that characters can detect obstacles or people and could react automatically to the environments, for example, cleaning the steps, going up and down the stairs, and so on. So, if you want to check out the awesome free iCloud course, you can click the link down below in the description. And if you want to learn about iCloud, you can check out our video about it. We mentioned that iCloud is one of the best alternatives to Maya and Motion Builder simply because it proved itself as an industry level production tool that can produce the same level of animation, especially with the release of iCloud 8, producing cutting edge animations for a fraction of the cost effort, and more importantly, in my opinion the time that is required by other applications. It also has wide support for industry-leading motion formats, and the ability to export to any format is of course a given. But where iCloud excels is its ability to handle an industry standard mocap format with a simple drag and drop. So the highlight is it is really straightforward and easy. Furthermore, iClone supports Motion Builder slash Maya Pipeline using FBX Roundtrip workflow, and this will allow you to take advantage of its powerful native features. In addition, this will help translate precise poses, finger gestures with motion transfer, making the collaboration across multiple software easy and enjoyable. So again, if you are interested in iClone 8 or the course itself, you will find the necessary links in the description. I hope you guys found this video useful and informative, if you did, please give it a thumbs up, you can also take a look at some of our previous videos, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.